This six rotor personal drone would be an awesome way to get around. Ever since the Jetsons, who hasn't dreamed of owning a flying car? That day an electrical vertical takeoff and landing vehicle can replace the gas guzzler in the driveway. But what if you just want a zip around the neighborhood? Well, then the Solexa is the whip for you. The Solexa is designed for shorter flights of about 20 minutes. Imagine skipping over traffic on your way to work. Or you and a friend can explore the countryside in a Solexa, which is way cooler than taking an ATV. Its designers also think the police might find the Solexa useful. Cops riding a Solexa could quickly respond to a crime scene and then report back to a command center. Navigation would be automated. Punch in coffee shop and the Solexa is programmed to take you there. The Solexa has a 200 pound payload, a 30 meter height ceiling, and a maximum flying time of about 20 minutes. At this point, the concept is just a concept, much like flying cars that fold into a briefcase. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Here are some more flying vehicle concepts. Jetpack Company comes out with electric VTOL concept. After giving the world its first working jetpack, David Maimon and company are bringing to life yet another science fiction dream. Flying cars. Jetpack Aviation is designing a new single-seat electric multicopter, equipped with six arms, 12 propellers, and landing balls instead of skids. Each arm on the VTOL aircraft comes with two propellers, one mounted on top and another underneath. They spin in opposite directions. The flying car will only be able to travel up to 90 miles per hour and operate up to 20 minutes before it needs to be recharged. Two of the middle arms will be designed to fold in so that the vehicle will be low and thin enough to fit inside a garage. Jetpack Aviation is currently developing a safety system for the project, with the team estimating that they will begin building the device in about six months. Uber reckons you'll be able to hail a flying cab by 2026. Ride hailing company Uber released a very intriguing white paper last month the nearly 100-page document envisions a future where commuters jetting city to city in compact aircraft could be as normal as taking the train to work. Uber's prediction of a world with commonplace urban air transit systems relies heavily on the widespread use of small self-flying electric aircraft with vertical takeoff and landing capability. Also known as VTOL, it's most commonly used by helicopters, as well as a small number of military aircraft. Uber says a network of VTOL hubs or landing pads, dubbed VertiPorts and VertiStops, could be used as terminals to ferry passengers around. Unlike cars, buses, and trains, VTOLs aren't susceptible to traffic jams or delays. They can fly from A to B with no fixed route. Uber estimates the cost of a 15-minute flight may eventually reach as low as $21. Uber expects the aircraft could fly at cruise speeds of around 150 miles per hour and won't go above 10,000 feet. The VTOL would be powered by rechargeable batteries that would maintain 30 minutes of reserve energy. Uber won't manufacture the aircraft, but predicts the market will have produced them by the early 2020s. Uber needs to collaborate with governments in the private sector for this to become a reality, so that could take longer than a decade, especially on the regulatory side.
Futurists pin flying car hopes on electric VTOL vehicles. Ever since the Jetsons, we've looked forward to the promise of flying cars. But it's not just a Hollywood dream anymore. Several companies hope to bring electric VTOL vehicles to the skies. That's VTOL for vertical takeoff and landing. Imagine leaving the office after a long day's work. You get to your VTOL vehicle parked on the roof of your office. Within minutes, you're soaring above skyscrapers and busy commuter traffic. There are no traffic jams for you. A half hour later, you're at your luxury villa by the beach. Sound far-fetched? It's not if you're Google co-founder Larry Page. This is a photo of what's believed to be the first electric VTOL vehicle from Z.Aero, which Page is funding. Lilium Jet is another electric VTOL craft aimed at the masses. This S2 from Joby Aviation will get you there in style. Even ride-sharing service Uber thinks one day passengers will take VTOLs to work. Hopefully that day won't be too much longer. Remember the Jetsons envisioned flying cars more than 50 years ago.